All right, so we are getting ready to go to Cayo Costa. I'm going to be camping for three days there. Uh, we're going to be taking this beautiful uh, Tropic Star Ferry. Cayo Costa is a barrier island just north of Captiva and Sanibel. And um, it's going to be a good time. We're going to collect some shells. Uh, and I'm going to take you along for all of that journey. So it's going to be a lot of fun. So I'll see you in a little bit. Right, so we are on Kyle Costa. I just got my tent set up. We had the worst torrential thunderstorm. All of my clothes got wet, my bag got wet, my tent got wet, my sleeping bag got wet. But I'm here on Kyle Costa and I'm gonna do some showing. So that makes me happy. I'll deal with the rest later. I love Kyle Costa, it's so beautiful. It's been two years since I've been here. No one is here. The ocean is beautiful. I'm telling you, this is literally what it's all about. Look at that color of the water. I'm happy I'm here. I'm not gonna do any cinematic shots tonight because I'm tired and wet. But we're gonna do some shelling before the next thunderstorm gets here. The rest of the few days that I'm here should be beautiful. So let's go check it out. Kyle Costa is known for having a lot of shells. Uh, it's just north of Sanibel Island, so there's a lot of shells that wash up here. Um, you can see in the drift, there's lots of cockles, carditas, sereths. We'll keep looking. I'm not gonna film everything on my walk, but I gotta, oh, look at this, this is interesting. So, someone left a pile of fighting conks here. But we're gonna get our own, so let's go down. Oh, I'm so excited! Kyle Costa! Let's go! So, first thing I noticed are these beautiful little uh, red urchins that are here. I don't know the name of those, but I'll, I'll look them up. That's a. First thing I noticed here on the beach, there is a very large half-eaten lightning whelk here. Uh, we'll go keep going. So there is a beautiful, ah, stepping on a bunch of clamshells. Look at this cockle. My gosh, this is gorgeous. Whew, I don't want to get hit by the water. I don't normally keep these, but I'm gonna keep this one. This is just gorgeous. Look at that is a bivalve. That is a uh, that's a cockle shell. I can't remember if it's a strawberry cockle or, uh, but I'm gonna keep that one. That's gorgeous. So one of the first things I notice is there's a little, literally a wall of shells here. You can see here. Uh, I'd love to dig some of that out because I'm pretty sure that if you did, like look, there's, there's sereths here. Oh, sorry, there's a sereth. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure if I pulled some of this out, we could probably find some keepers in here. This is just probably all added up from storms here. Uh, wow, that's there's so many shells in there. That is beautiful, man. I have to come check that out. Beautiful keyhole sand dollar. That is gorgeous. So, a little lightning whelk. That's cute. A lot of shells here in this pile. Coquina here. Of coquina clams. It's a coquina. I am really fearful that this storm is chasing me down here. So I must be careful. I don't want to end up in the rain again. Or worse, in the lightning. Because that's not fun. Very large calico clam here. the end of the point here at Cayo Costa. There's a, a little point. Uh, excuse me, with a lightning whelk. Um, let's see. I'll keep my eye down so that we can explore this together. Another really nice, beautiful calico scallop. This looks like a fresh pile here. I don't think anyone was out here today because it rained pretty much all day. But I do feel like that storm is coming in behind me. And it is concerning. So I just want to make sure I'm not getting caught in that. But I will take you here as long as I can. And then I'll have to run back <laughs> to my tent. Because I don't want to get wet again. Just look at all the shells that are here, though. This is Cayo Costa for you. The shells just roll up on the beach here. Really pretty lightning whelk here. That is a beautiful lightning whelk. I'm gonna keep the camera rolling here because there's a lot of drift. Drift doesn't always mean shells, but many times, ooh, I definitely don't wanna get wet. Many times when there's piles of drift, you can find some, oh, okay, definitely don't want to get wet again. You can find some keepers. So it looks like there's a lot of minis, but if we look, I think the tide might be coming in. So, okay, there's a spiny jewel box there. Shark eye here. Nice little shark eye moon. Very beautiful one. Keep looking here. Let me know if you see anything that I miss because 
I'm going a little quickly here because I don't want to get caught in the rainstorm. Ah. Or just a lightning well. I don't know what that is, but that's really pretty. I see there's so many shells here, everybody. This does look like it's all fresh. Another beautiful calico scallop here. I believe that's a calico scallop. Lettered olive. I have a million of those. I don't need another one. I'll leave it for another sheller. Storm is coming in. I gotta. I gotta make this quick here. Another shark eye. And right above it is an albino whelk. Yeah. Another whelk here. And a really nice lettered olive. So I literally just found those. Another lightning whelk here. So many guys. I'm probably gonna have to run back to my tent in about three minutes. But I can feel the breeze starting. I hope this isn't too much tension for you all. Uh, I'm not trying to create tension. I'm trying to create enjoyment so you can shell with me here in this beautiful area that is Cayo Costa. I got here tonight and I wanted to get down here to do a little shelling. There's a beautiful lightning whelk. Um, and I saw that I had a couple minutes to get down here through the intermittent thunderstorms that we are having today. Look at that bad boy. Holy crap, that's big. This. Wow. have a lot. All right, I have to, um, I think I'm going to stop here because you can see the storm behind me. I'm not kidding. It's a bad storm and I don't want to get caught out in it. Always safety first. I'm probably pushing it a little bit too far here, um, but I just couldn't help it. I'm so excited to be here, uh, but I, I don't want to, I don't want to get myself in trouble here. So if I can come back out today, I will do that, but right now I'm gonna run back uh, to my tent. Uh, look at how beautiful the water is. Look at this. Look at that contrast of aqua water with the impending storm here. All right, All right I'll catch you guys shortly. Um, if I don't come back tonight, hopefully this was a fun little shelling adventure, and I'll see you soon. Thank you for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the content. If you did, please consider hitting that subscribe button and I will see you on the next shelling adventure.